here we are. We are taking a trip to our local public fishing area. Everybody's here in the car. Say hi. hi. Hello. And Dad is driving back from deployment. Hi. And so here we are. We're going to spend some time fishing since he has a ton of time off. We enjoy fishing. We also picked up a mystery tackle box. It's box number six. Right? Box number six. Okay, so it's box number six, and we're going to try it out at our public fishing area to see if we can catch some bass today. So hopefully, we'll have some luck. It's pretty cold, if though. We like, if we can figure out how to use it. Oh my gosh, it was like 80 degrees yesterday, but today, of course, is 61. So, half a mile, turn right onto Paradise Drive. Thank you. Anyway, so, um, so yeah, we also have been telling the kids for days that we'll get gas, we will get ice at the gas station before we leave. And guess what? We did not get, we did not get ice. So, we do not have ice in the cooler. Not sure how that's going to work out. Just keep driving and see if we might find a gas station Turn somewhere right to get nice drive. And then so we're gonna see how this goes and we'll come back and show you how much fun we have today. All right, so here we are. We have found a general store right down the street from our For the ice, we forget. fishing area. And so Dad's gonna go and pick up some ice to correct that little error that we made. So there he goes. Woohoo! So we're gonna pick up some ice and then we will be on our way to do some fishing. Now, I'm really excited about this mystery tackle box because we've never done anything like that but you want out we're gonna get out in just a second we're gonna go fishing are you excited Mallory that is not your chair girl are you ready to go fishing yeah this is gonna be super exciting so we're gonna be doing a lot of um, videoing different things so I have no idea what's really gonna be in this video but I really wanted you know, to see what we do for fun because when dad's home we like to fish. Also, another thing is that we have the kids um, getting prepped for entering into the art contest that the state holds, or I guess, I don't know, it might be all over the country anyway, but there's a fishing art contest. And so we're pretty much just out here trying to get a real look at what some of the fish look like before they start practicing their drawings. Um, so that just started yesterday, the art contest, and it goes, they'll have to submit their stuff in March. So we're going to be spending some time looking at fish and learning about fish, and they know quite a bit about freshwater fish um, because Dad likes to fish. But other than that, um, we're just hoping to have some fun. You can't get out. Dad's just going to get some ice real quick, okay? Hi. Then we're going to go right back down the street to go fishing. Yep. Woohoo. Yep. All right, so we can have five largemouth bass. Yeah. What are we looking for is a catfish. We can have five catfish. We have five catfish. Is that channel cat? Channel cat, yeah. The brown bullhead has no limit. All right. <coughs> What's the size limit? There is none. All right, Any so no size. All right. Any combination of sunfish, brim, species. So the only size limit that we're looking for is 14 inch largemouth bass. Yep. Uh, Alright, we're going to pick up some more mags. Magazines, we've already got the fishing magazine. Just checking our rules here. Now we have fished here before, but you know it's always good for you to recheck to make sure nothing has changed. As we see this change out. Oh, the Georgia Bass Slam. When is that? Is that old? No, that's, oh, that's five of Georgia's ten eligible black bass All right, take a picture of that so we can see. You're supposed to catch five out of ten. 
So we'll know which what 10 we're looking for. I guess it is the 10. Anyway. Alright, so. Just PSA. When you're fishing, don't forget your license. It's very important. So we both have our licenses in Georgia. Anybody can fish under 16. None of our kids are 16. So we have our fishing licenses. Our first fishing spot for the fall season is here at Paradise. So fishing open 24 hours a day. We might try this out here. Okay, so one of the reasons why I prefer to fish here at Paradise is because it is a lot of little fishing areas and we can choose to move around if we want. Oh. Bird. There you right there. There's a lot of wildlife which we like to look at. So I've got my video camera. I also have my actual camera. Ooh, put your seatbelt on. <laughs> um, but, but there's a whole lot of things. So, so like there's fishing, like Paradise has a whole lot of little fishing spots all around so like they're back up in there so you just drive around from fishing plate fishing spot to fishing like. spot <gasps> and so with this mystery tackle box it's going to be great because if Let's we don't catch daddy. in one spot we'll just pack up and see if we can catch in another spot now we are out here trying to do some bass fishing because we have this new bass mystery tackle box but if we catch anything else as long as it's large enough to eat we're actually going to take it home and try to see if we can get the kids um, to learn a little bit about scaling some fish and cooking it up. All right, so we've got the little kids out there. Reedster, are you fishing, bud? Are you gonna catch a big one? So we've got that going on. We're setting Tuck Tuck up now. Mackenzie put his pajamas on. So he's yes. warm. You got your pajamas on because it's cold today. <laughs> yes, it is. All right, so we've got his tent set up. So here we go. Yeah, I'm All right, so we've already got our very first injury. Is that mine? First aid. But it doesn't hurt that much. Yeah. I haven't been here 10 minutes. All right. <laughs> but that's the part of fish. You're being a good sport, bud. All right. So. Say, so you have fun fishing too, don't you? With your warm jammies on. Yeah. Say, so I love to sit out here in the outside. You're an outdoors boy. Yes, you are. Silly goose. <laughs> Okay, so Reedster and I are here, and we are going to check out our mystery tackle box to see what is in box number six. Okay, so here we go. Mallory, what do you have? Look! All right, reel it in. No, you don't go walk forward. You bring it up on the ground. <laughs> look, look, reel it up. Look! Awesome! And then we have Reister over here. He's got something on his too. Oh boy! Ooh. Oh, you got a mad one. Oh, you got a mad one. Oh, Reed, oh, what do you have? God. You see that? Oh my God! <laughs> Reister, we gotta catch it. Look at that! Reister, we oh gotta catch goodness. it. All right. Oh, no. Look at that. All about right. the same size. Oh, good. Oh, my oh, God. God. Get him. Reel it in, bud. This you is what it's it. like fishing with the children. I'm coming. I'm coming. You got it. All Just right. let it sit there for a All second. Right. We're going to measure it. Oh, uh-oh. I think he's all. Yeah. Oh, man. Okay, so that was exciting. Dad, now we're back to the box here. Yeah, you can put them in a cooler. You help me, Dad? Poor thing. Have a... Okay. Alright, so here we are back to our box that we've already used. See, a little bit dirty here. Um, anyway, we've caught 
two catfish and a largemouth already. Just with some regular um, night crawlers, which is our preferred bait of choice. But here we have this box. And the first thing in this box says oh, oh, oh. Punisher Punisher Pun <laughs> Punisher Punch Crawls. Uh -oh. Right, there's eight each. Reed, you got another fish. Reed Star Bud. Go catch your fish. Like I'm not even gonna be able to make this video if we can catch keep catch fish like this. Okay, but anyway. So we also have an excavator. Oh my gosh! Like I'm not gonna be able to do the box. Look at the catfish. Y'all, this is no joke. Lynn and I talked last night about Lynn, let me turn this around. Lynn and I talked last night about the fact that we really wanted to catch some catfish today. Even one. Our goal was to catch one catfish so that we could take it home show the kids how to clean it and cook it up yeah, make pliers. catfish nuggets so the kids can taste it y'all we've been here like 30 minutes <laughs> this is our fourth fish third catfish okay no limit on size here so we got three catfish that we get to go home and cook today right now we did not at all come prepared so they're in some bags on ice <laughs> <laughs> that is how God provides, right? We asked for one. So far, we've got three. This is awesome. So here he is. Okay, here, let me hold it. That's hot and spicy, baby. Go over there and take a picture with your fish. Let me get the phone. This is my little thing. I feel bad. Well, you can throw it back if you want. Cheese. We're back to the mystery tackle box. Okay. Kenzie has opened this right here because she wanted, she's excited here. I want to she's try already one. caught the first bass of the day, so she's trying to try out something new to see if she can get something a little bit bigger. Now, if the bass aren't 14 inches, they got to go back. So, we're going to try to catch something bigger than that. This is a sweet spot nine. tackle. Again, this is from Mystery Tackle Box, box number six. So, and I like this. See that right there? I can't barely even see it. Right there. See that? We need more of that right there. All right, so she's going to try these sweet bass. spot tackles. I'm trying to catch a bigger bass. Um, these lures here, she's gonna, her daddy's gonna show her how to stick that on there and she's gonna try to uh, fish with that. But we also have, here is, this is from Carl's Amazing Baits. This is the Hunch. Okay. All right, it's from Carl's Bait and Tackle. So look them up online. So we'll put this on one of the kids. Uh, rods here pretty soon. This is the one that I was looking at last night. It's a football jig. It's pretty cool. Might get this on axles because it matches his rod. Alright, so. Alright, football jig. We also have a sticker in the box. And, oh, I was, when I turned it off, uh, we, we were looking at the excavator jig right here. It's a shaky head jig. So we'll stick this one on to somebody's rod here. All right, so that is what, I believe that's everything that came in here unless somebody took off with something. Again, this is our mystery tackle box. So we're gonna start getting some of these. Um, we grab the bass, the one for bass fishing because that's pretty much what we do. So we don't really do any trout fishing. But so we'll see how it goes. Okay, so here we go. We think Axel's got one here. We all have new rods, by the way. That was one of the gifts that we gave ourselves from post-deployment. Everybody got a brand new rod. We're not really brand specific. It's pretty much, we've been fishing with ugly sticks for a while. Or Shakespeare, yeah. And so some of them have Shakespeare's and some of them just pick the color. So we're not really a rod specific family, even though ugly stick is probably my favorite. Just because that's what I got him for our wedding, our wedding gift. <laughs> oh, okay, so Dad's just gonna spend his day hopping back and forth because there it goes. <laughs> so this is what it's like. This is what it's like to. Uh, what is this fun? But your your rod's not gonna go anywhere. Axel, come here. Don't be scared. Just reel it. Don't let it go. 
y'all like seriously like seriously you pray and have the right heart about it our whole purpose out here is to spend time with our kids and teach them to enjoy what God has given us and here God is certainly providing we have five catfish and a bass which we had to throw back the bass because he wasn't big enough but here we are we haven't even been here an hour so this video might seem like a long one but it's really not oh I think he lost it <laughs> Jason think he might have something in here yeah no maybe Do you not have it? Oh no, this ain't moving. Reel in until you feel tension. And if it starts jumping, set the hook. You feel tension? I see tension. Is it caught on something? I can clearly see you got tension. Tension. I got caught on something. Well, pull it. Alright, hold on. You're cold. Don't, pull. Don't break the line. Jackson, wait, let your daddy do it, please. Mallory, do you have a fish on there, honey? Oh, I see the seaweed moving. No. Nope. Yeah, I see the one too. Okay. Not yet. <laughs> 